Hey guys, what's up? What's good? It's me, your boy Mike Matei, coming at you with a little different video today. This is uh, stuff that I picked up at the 2018 All-Star Game Fan Fest in Washington, D.C. So I traveled up there for the day and uh, picked up some cool stuff. First thing they gave you was this uh, Ryan Zimmerman bobblehead. It's not that big. It's about, uh, it's about three and a half inches long. Uh, yeah, almost four inches. Ryan Zimmerman, pretty cool bobblehead. So it uh, comes with a bat. Comes with a bat. Just stick it in uh, between his fist there. So uh, that was cool. Little Ryan Zimmerman. Then the I went to Tops. Tops had a uh, interactive game where you picked some cards and you try not to make an out. And there was a point system, and you could either win a, a Tops bunt pennant. A tops poster, which is what I wanted. They had Manny Machado there yesterday and a couple of other guys, but uh, I ended up with the bunt because I didn't I didn't uh, accumulate enough points. Then I went to the uh, the Chevrolet uh, exhibit and they had a whole bunch of cars there, and you had to sc uh, scan your QRC code and go through the whole process of checking in at different stations and. At the end, you win a prize, and this was the prize. It was a uh, American versus National All Star Game pennant by sponsored by Chevrolet, so that was cool. Then uh, Geico had a station also, and uh, you go there, you put it, you scan your QRC code, and uh, this is what I won. I won a rally towel, All Star Game uh, rally towel. So uh, then uh, I waited online for two hours, man, for this. Uh, Autographed by Huang Marichal, and uh, apparently he had a lot of ink on his hands, and uh, transferred onto my ball. But uh, two hours to get his autograph—that was the worst part, man. I didn't think we were gonna make it. I think I thought they were gonna end end the uh, session at it went from 10 to 12, and he actually stood there till about quarter to one signing. There were so many people there, but you waited at this station so long, I missed the opportunity to get other guys. So. What can you do? But I asked him to sign uh, Dominican Dandy. He said no. He was going to sign Hall of Fame. And then he signed it Dominican Dandy anyway. So thank you, Mr. Huang Marichal. Hall of Fame. He's getting pretty up there in years. Um, appreciate that he took the time to actually sign Dominican Dandy. Uh, then I picked up this cool like lithograph of uh, by a Canadian artist. His name is S. Preston. He's from Canada somewhere. And uh, he had several different ones. He had one with a cherry blossom tree. And he had a few of them with uh, states, different uh, mascots, I'm sorry. And uh, so this was pretty cool. It's uh, Abraham Lincoln with, with uh, some eye black there. It's the Lincoln Monument. And he added eye black there to Lincoln. So that's pretty cool. Washington, D.C. All-Star game. So it got a little bend up on my way back. I, I didn't drive, I took a bus, and it was pretty crowded and stuff, and my bag was small, so that was uh, 30 of 200, and uh, got a little squashed up, but I'm going to get some autographs on it from the people who, uh, hopefully uh, down the line I get some autographs from the people who uh, participated in the All-Star Game, the 2018 All-Star Game, it's going to be a little pricey I'm sure, and a lot of guys won't sign, you guys like Harper and Judge and stuff like that, but I'll get whoever I can, but this was cool. And uh, finally, the last piece I picked up were the Topps Redemption cards. Uh, you had to buy 12 packs of cards. Uh, tw yeah, 12 packs of cards uh, for each. Uh, yeah, 12 packs of cards and then give them the 12 wrappers and you got a complete set. So number one in the set was uh, Mike Trout. And it's got that little all-star game. Uh, little sign there says Washington, D.C. So, uh, Mike Trout was number one in that set, and, uh, Matt Sch Max Scherzer, number two, uh, Chris Bryant, number three, uh, Bryce Harper was number four, Altuve, number five, and last but not least, Aaron Judge. So, uh, if you just wanted Aaron Judge cards, you went up to the top, uh, booth and you opened up two packs of cards 
and uh, you were able to you were able to uh, pick up a judge card. So there you have it. That was uh, everything I picked up at the uh, Fan Fest. There were a lot of interactive stations, a lot of things for kids to do. It's mostly geared towards children. So, uh, you know, they have a good time. They have these humongous fields. They have athletes who uh, participate with them on the field. And uh, it's a good time for everybody. It's a real cool family event. So, uh, I don't have any kids, so I went solo. And, uh, I got a picture with Carlos Baerga, so uh, it was pretty cool. I also got a, an autograph from Manny Sanguin. Uh I put the picture away already, but uh, man, Manny Sanguin's signatures, uh, he, he's really deteriorating, man. But uh, okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this uh, quick recap from my experience at the All-Star Game Fan Fest. If you did, give it a thumbs up, and uh, like, share, and... Next time I get an autograph, usually I do autograph TTM uh, videos, but this was a special one. It was from my experience at the Fan Fest. So, uh, hopefully I'll see you guys soon when I get something in my mailbox. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed this quick video. Take care, God bless, see you soon. Peace out.